Hello, welcome back to another video. We're gonna do the what I expect to be the last and final mission of Jan Shishka campaign. It's number six, Warrior of God. And without further ado, let's do it. War turns fine men into circling ravens and makes tyrants of us all. The faithless falter and new enemies rise as old ones fall. With Sigismund gone, I turned to smashing the few remaining pockets of royalist resistance. The Hussite dream of a Bohemia independent from the grip of foreign imperial powers was nearly achieved when misfortune struck us once more. Jealous of my success on the field of battle and lusting after the power that I have justly earned, a faction of Hussites in Prague turned from the righteous path and made a deal with the devil. Now they march in league with the royalist armies and call on Sigismund to return. My Hussites are undefeated, but it would be a fool's errand to contend with internal dissent and invasion at once. I have appealed to my former comrades in Poland and Lithuania for help, and one man and his army have answered the call. Gigimantis Koribut, an ambitious young duke with a fierce love for our cause. We have come far already, and our mission to bring freedom, peace, and justice to our beloved homeland will not be stopped now. With our eastern allies by our side, we shall smite the royalist oppressors in the north, while our Hussite allies in Tabor strike out from the west. Once more, we shall unify this broken land and remind Sigismund that the Hussites are no mere peasant rabble to be oppressed and trampled. If he enters Bohemia again, he will face the wrath of men inspired by the soul of the martyr Jan Hus and see that Jan Shishka, warrior of God, still leads this unconquerable army. All right. So, uh, main objective is to defeat Prague, Pilsen, and the Royalists. Jan Shiska begins in the Imperial Age and can support a population limit of 200. You begin with a sizable army, way your options, a quick strike could cripple an opponent, but it could also leave you and your ally exposed to enemy counterattacks. Your ally, Zygimant Zygimantas Koribut, <laughs> is that a real name? Will take control of Prague if he can reach the Saint, Saint Vitus Cathedral. Avoid leveling the city, lest you obtain no more than a smoking ruin. Most of Bohemia's mineral resources have been mined and spent during the ruthless conflicts of the recent years. Supplement your income by trading with your allies and prevent your enemies from doing the same. The Hussite reforms technology in the Castle Age makes monks and monastery technologies considerably more affordable when gold is scar scarce. Consider researching it and supporting your armies with groups of monks. Wait. Hussite reforms technology in the castle. Oh, in the castle. I thought they said it's in the Castle Age, it's actually in the Imperial Age. Yeah, the hero looks nice there in the background for sure. Jan Shishka has arrived from the southeast, confident after a string of decisive victories. His army is poised to seize the remainder of Bohemia. The allied Hussite stronghold of Tabor lies to the south, defended by a force of Hussite wagons, engineers, and pikemen. Royalist forces camp to the northeast and will send light cavalry, skirmishes, swordsmen, and siege engines into battle. In the north, the Utraquist Hussites of Prague have made a common cause with the enemy, fueling a force of crossmen, infantry, and Hussite wagons. The German rulers of Pilsen dominate the west of the map with armies of cavalry, infantry, monks, and siege engines. Vitotus' nephew, the Lithuanian magnet Sigmantus Koribut, is an ally of the Hussites. Given the opportunity, he will support Chiska's cause with pikemen, skirmishes, and heavy cavalry. Roger that. Warriors of God, you need not flee before your Stop enemies. Him. Fight boldly and fulfill your dream of an independent Bohemia. Roger, I guess this is Jan, because we cannot click him. 
Don't know why, but I cannot click him. There's a market there, so we will trade there. I'm gonna guess this is Jan. We just cannot use him because he's blind. But... Yeah, I don't know. Oh. It's the other guy. Okay, so we got the Cory boot guy. Uh, do I want to attack someone right away? Question mark. I do not know. I could go up here. Against the royalists already. We are in Imperial Age. There's a relic right there. I don't have siege yet though. We should have chemistry research right away because we are we get that in the castle. The bridge baited me. I thought it was a relic looking at the minimap. I mean, those those things aren't strong, right? Sentry tower. Okay, they're not too bad. Yeah. A little bit wasteful with troops, but okay. It's fine. I just don't understand how they haven't added another. Like, it's impossible to hear these these dialogue sounds. Do not understand how they have not been adjusted, or no one has thought about adding their own slider for that. Hard to understand how. Have you ever remembered to get faith for the village movement? Faith? Faith is not for village movement. You're talking about fervor. Yeah, fervor. Um, since we start in the Imperial Age, we have that automatically researched this time. But I do remember that sometimes, yes. We just need some more bomber cannons. Beat Prague, Pilsen and the Royalist. Bring Sigmantus Corbut to the St. Vitus Cathedral. To be there. So I should probably try to make an attack from the left side. So I can just send him in there and probably seize control of it just like that. That would be quite nice indeed. It's not how we wanted to fight there. Wait, we can convert that. Do I go straight for Hoofness? I go straight for Hoofness. It's too good of an upgrade to ignore. This is where you want me? Confusing. Yeah, it's a bit awkward here. Very like the going across the bridge is a little bit rough and awkward, but it's fine. We survive. Especially like there's towers with so much different range here that's very awkward to engage. But I guess we just have to take it slow. Slow and steady. Should make Marcus further away. That would give me more gold. Make one there. Okay. 
I think we had pop limit of 200 this one. If I remember correctly. Okay, no more towers in the area. We have Hoofnis. Okay, we don't want to get hit by the manga now. Oh, it's not pretty, not pretty at all. Oh, okay, micro, am I right? Ah, oh, shit. I'm making this so much more difficult by trying to attack with these unit numbers. Wait, where's the hero? <gasps> oh, do tell me he comes back from the dead. Uh... Our ally Shiki Mantis has fallen. I'm not gonna lie, that kind of sucks. Oh, how did that happen even? Uh, sad. So sad. Very sad. Oh my god, can we just... I hate these bridges, man. They're repairing the castle even. Why don't you try hearts? Can we just pass here? Units, please. Uh. Oh my god, this is so tail triggering. Can we just. Seriously, are you kidding me? I don't even care, I'm gonna sacrifice all these units just to get this. I don't care about anything else. <laughs> I have to go back. Oh. Why do choke points and bridges exist? I wonder if they have redemption. Because if not, I could convert that. I will not restart. I refuse. Okay, they have redemption. Alright, um, where are we at? We have way too much wood. Let's do some farming. Bring some of these to repair those. Okay, we just need to build up the numbers a little bit. It's fine. Back from the right side. There's a bridge there as well. Now... It's not as close to the castle, so yeah, maybe the right side would have been better. But I'm committed. I... Oh my god, I lost one. Wait, I'm being attacked. Why oh, do they have so many units? Uh-uh. <gasps> uh-uh. I'm dying. <laughs> no, please. Yeah, I don't think going full anchors is the best idea right now. We just need to keep our Hussite wagons alive. The rest we can. Best we can sort of uh, recover numbers on. We have production buildings now. So that is fine. Uh, 
All right, I guess we go skirms. Might should add some melee units into the mix. I got a feel on it. Hate those ramps they keep sending in. Okay, I think the skirms will help us now, just trading effectively for the time being. What is that enemy? Okay, we need to add some barracks. Right, all good. Worth it. No! <laughs> Damn it. I'm being monk crushed. Please, can we just make some progress somewhere? Don't dare convert my archer range. Sounds like something got converted. AK, I lost an archer range. Right, we got clapped. Hey, it's early days still. I, I think we're still fine. Could have been better. I'm not gonna lie. But we're fine. This awkward bridge here is a pain in the butt. But we are close enough now. We're gonna take it down. Uh, no, it's, no, it's not. You do not know what you're talking about, sir. Let's add some more wheels, because we actually will have to add more economy. What? How were they fine hitting the caster for so long, and all of a sudden they cannot hit it anymore? I do not understand. Come on, one more volley. Let's go. Yes! Okay. I'm, I'm pretty much making full trash units here, which is not great. Just got some Arbalest. I'm, I'm honestly gonna, gonna add champions even. I think it makes sense. Yeah, alright, alright. So where are we at here? I did not expect them to attack with so many units. Am I ally even doing anything? Nope. What was I expecting? This is fine though. It's fine. Boom. I think we have enough to fend it off for now, so we'll start sending units to the top again. And I want to break through and get rid of green ASAP. He's dodging everything. Stop it. I'm making champs because they're good against... Oh, it's not against Teutonic Knights, but... Things like this when skirms, helps, and ramps are... Are, uh, you know, dropping in. I think it's nice to have... Some champions in the mix. We do have supplies as well, so it's... Oh my god. Do I have... Oh, I do have heavy scorpions. Interesting. Oh, there's so many bomber here. Boom. Yeah, let's go back. We need more barracks. Actually, I have more barracks. I'm just not producing from them. Okay, we're fine. Need more farms. Got some bomb cannons? Yes. Last one? One more. 
There we go. Actually being top cap pretty soon. And purple is actually doing something, so happy days. And we have seven hot side wagons. Good stuff. I think we're finally getting to the numbers we need. My castle to defend my base. I ain't got stone, but it would have been nice to have one. As long as there's no big wave of units coming right now, we have... Oh, don't die. Units, please. Live. Repair. Repair. Oh. Lost one. But this seems quite wasteful to just send units in there, but just sit. Oh my god, am I gonna lose? Don't tell me I'm gonna lose the ramps. I lost one. Okay, it should be fine. Still unnecessary difficult. These guys are annoying. Let's get rid of Green's production buildings, okay? Get rid of those. Oh man, he's making those annoying monks. Stop converting my stuff, man. Please. I need them to be alive. Thank you. Okay, there are towers shooting from us from every angle. Okay, I think we have enough there. 70 villagers. I can probably justify adding a couple more. I think it makes sense, even. With the amount of units we've had to uh, make here. Get rid of the barracks there, and then there's just those two buildings, and I think green is out of it. I think. Hope. And hope. Oh, the price for gold is actually insane. Okay, on we move. I think actually I'll keep them here. This red keeps sending waves. Probably all this TC there as well. I think if we take that out. I'm not sure if they will fight on. Hope not. And? Give up, Royalists. You ain't got nothing left. Maybe the range in the market as well, and then that's it. Oh, they have a TC up there as well. Okay, yeah, we move to that one. We will... Oh, there's a lot of gold up there. There's a lot of gold up there. That will come in handy. I just, wanna, I want, just want Green to resign, okay? So I don't have to think about him anymore. There we go. Resign. Give up, Royalists. It's a relic there. Oh, finally. We respect about you, Hussites. But we cannot deny your superiority on the field of battle. Very well. We will surrender. Finally. All right, uh, walls of Porzenia. The town will surely be lost before our knights could hope to arrive. Is it because I sent units here? Might be. Okay, 
A scourge, O oh Lord, come to punish us for our pride and earthly sins. Yes. Does shift Q even work? No, it doesn't. Still haven't fixed that. Monk conversion noise. Top 10 worst noises to hear. I got completely clapped. Let's make a hanker in their army. Um, add like a couple of hoof knees. And halberdiers. That's going to be the perfect army here. Not sure if it's worth it for me to continue pursuing this up here. Not sure if we have enough troops, rather. Please stop shooting things. You just kill more of our own units. I feel like they're more. They shoot more things than. Bomber cannons do. And onagers and things like that. I don't know though. Yeah, this norm here. Look how tanky it is. 10 pierce armor. Crazy. Even the melee units take forever to kill it. That's insane. I'm gonna build a castle there. Oh, it's even stone. Bomber cannon got some solid damage in. I feel like I probably don't have enough to push orange here. But let's just get that castle up. And take it from there. Yeah, all my units are kind of gone. Can I just like put target fires on the bridge and they will always think twice about crossing? If they cross, they will always take damage, pretty much. That's nice. <laughs> Spit. Look how indecisive they are, because there's always shots coming in, so they never want to cross. <laughs> That's nice. And when they do come across, I have enough units here to kill units one by one. Auto micro indeed. Okay. Uh, what else? I have to take this the old-fashioned way, they said. Maybe I just send my army and work from the top. There's a bridge there. That city is huge. I might have to add military units up there. Or buildings. Um, maybe make an attack from here as well. Let's try. <laughs> they don't know what to do. That's nice. Let's add some more. Wait, that's the problem. Destroy it. Okay, now we're fine. Uh, maybe send some veils and make some buildings here as well. Wait, what? Yo, guys, no one told you you can do that. That's actually insane. Hey, I love bridges. I've always loved bridges. They just make it so nice to defend against AI. Got my monk, indeed. Let's do university there, uh, monastery there. Enemy 
Enemy forces threaten Tabor. Where? Ah, oh, shit. Not again. Not again. I don't have population for this, man. To fight everywhere at the same time. For the love of God, stop making conversion noises, please. None of these build. I can't attack any of these buildings. Okay, we don't one shot them. Should probably pay attention to my base, see what's happening. Purple is actually helping me. Would you believe it? <gasps> Sneaky guy. He found a loophole in the matrix. Snipe it. Thank you. Okay, question is, do I just push on here? The cathedral? Wait, am I dying here? Hope not, but I wouldn't rule it out. Let's go for the castle. This is, maybe they stopped attacking now because they have to worry about defending. That could be what's happening. Oh my god, why are you guys so awkward? Sometimes I hate this pathing of DE with a passion. Yeah, I think they're sending everything on this side now. Okay. Well, castle should go down. Do I have to take the cathedral as well? Or take it down? Or do I just have to destroy everything they have and own? I'm not sure. We'll work our way through the castles. Oh, not like this. Forgot to check my base, but it uh, looks like we're fine. Let's go for a castler. It's risky, but... Okay, no, let's not go for a castler. Okay, another castle down. What else can we destroy here? What else is oranges? If anything. Doesn't look like anything. I guess we work our way in here. The gate. Yeah, I don't have to take out that. Oh, okay, we got the castle. That's good. I don't really have troops here anymore. That was a big hit. Two for one deal. Ah, the bumpkin is owning me! I feel like my units are so much more valuable since they're hoofnies, so I don't like that at all. I would love to drop a castle here as well and get it up. But it might be overly ambitious. I'm an ambitious guy, what can I say? Do I go for it? I'm going for it. There's a bumpkin in range, but I think we're fine. Okay, we're on the production buildings, so that's that's the definition of progress in missions like this. Okay, let's do a TC. There's a cow. There's a cow C even under there, or cow C. Live. Okay, good. Yeah, I think that is very good indeed. Double kill. I think they're out of juice, to like to say. 
Still no sense of red coming in for another attack. What else do they have that we could destroy? Town center. Let's take it. There's also a nice little tower in there. Pushing from the bottom at the same time. Okay, that will be the last stand, probably. Castle. Yeah, we have plenty of resources. I'm not concerned. On that front. Gold is not going to be an issue either, considering we have access to all of that. Hello, guys, wakey wakey. Don't die, don't die. Okay. Guess we prepare another group of Hoofnis. Oh, we've been blanked. Luckily, he doesn't know how to micro. Castle down. Progress. We shouldn't have too much left keeping them in the game. Man, this is taking some time. Like They require some work. Yeah, barracks. Just got to get rid of all the production buildings up here. Let's get rid of that. I think we just dive in here. Get rid of the siege workshops. I don't think they they have siege workshops left. So yeah, now it's just all about their production buildings, and they should call it a day. What? Where is there enemy siege? A bomber cannon there. At an end. These ultra quests had better rejoin our ranks. Or else. Okay, good stuff. So Prague is thrown in the towel. Good stuff. We move everything now to Plitzen. Or they come to us. One way or another. Shit's about to go down. And I don't think we will enjoy that fight very much. Where are you going, purple? There's nothing left up there. Shit. He wants civil war. Okay, we need some more barracks here. We have close to reinforcements. That's pretty much it. Purple, you are going in the wrong direction, my friend. I did do elite Hassan, Hassan wagon, Husit, Husite wagon. Whether it's, whether I should make any of those at this point, I'm not sure. I'm kind of torn on the unit still, I have to say. It's usefulness, if you will. Get the cathedral. I don't think I can anymore. I think I needed the hero to do that. I'll send one unit just in case. But I think I needed uh, a hero that uh, we may have lost quite early on uh, to accomplish that. Unfortunately. I mean, these things happen, you know. Could have happened to anyone. Yeah, we have a sizable force here. I'm building buildings quite far away. It'll work. You can't kill it by target fire, don't you? Do I want to kill it, though? I don't think I want to destroy it. There's no reason for me to destroy it. I don't think I have anything to gain from destroying it. Now we have a cathedral. 
I guess that's nice. Not more exciting than that. Ooh. Somehow they all managed to avoid the damage. Are they converting my siege? You have to be careful with that. Someone lose any of my hoofnies. Uh, I hate the conversion sound. What did, what got converted? Not sure if I want to know. I don't think... I mean, we're still trading efficiently, and I have enough resources. So I think we can just steamroll this. With our hoofness? I don't see how we do not, honestly. Yay, purple! <laughs> you made it to the city! Good job. Should make MBL's Bululu uh, the official conversion noise. I'm sure, some people would enjoy it. I wonder if they have crenellations here. What, guys? How about you guys come over here where the fight is happening and join in? Let's see, is it crenellations? It's not crenellations. Well, that is good news for me. Relic! Got the relic! It's not Age of Empires 4, my friend. You don't need a relic to convert. Those who don't know, you need relics to convert in Age of Empires 4. Saving the relic like a champ, indeed. Oh, there's even three of them. All right, Monument, I think you're about to go down in... I think two volleys should be enough. One. Never mind. I, I wanted to have it anyway. It's just so satisfying to one-shot buildings. It's just so satisfying. Especially when you can do double kill. Look look at those stables. Look at those stables here. Boom. Double kill. Even almost triple kill with the market. So satisfying. Okay, last thing to go down. We just need a castle down. And victory shall be ours. We shall have conquered. Jan Shushka and the Bohemians campaign. I think this will be it. They have a little bit of fight left in them by the looks of it. But there will be not much more. I guess there's a TC or something in the back here. Yeah, indeed. Just clicked. And... Boom. Victory! Has left the arrogant citizens of Pulzenia to a grim fate. Shall we be merciful, like the lion to the mouse, or vicious, like the eagle on Sigismund's back? Bohemia is now free of foreign emperors, dogmatic clerics, and wretched invaders. Goose's dream is complete at last. He stole the cathedral. Uh, but no, you cannot delete cathedrals, no. They stole my cathedral, man. Purple arrived just in time. <laughs> awesome. With the rival Hussite factions reconciled and the royalists defeated, nothing stands in our way. 
We will honor Jan Hus by building a Bohemia free from the corruption of the church in Rome and the avaricious talons of foreign emperors. Yet I, Jan Zizka, will not be there in earthly form to see it. To everything there is a season, and a time for every purpose under heaven. And my time under the sun is nearly over. Even now, I can feel the bubonic plague coursing through my veins, swiftly stripping the warmth and life from my aged bones. Ye who are warriors of God, hear my dying wish. After I expire, you will flay the skin from my corpse and use it to build the drums to whose beat this army will march henceforth. When our enemies hear the ominous din of those drums and the joyous clamor of thousands of valorous Hussites singing battle hymns, they will know one dreadful truth. Jan Shishka still leads this army from beyond nice. the grave. I think something that they have done really well in the new campaigns, let's say the last last seven, eight new introduced campaigns, these, um, what are those, what would you even call those? Introductions, cinematic, not cinematics, introductions, outros, cutscenes, yeah, cutscenes. They do those really well. The monologues, yeah. They, they have been really good, I would say, for the last, last couple of DLCs, I would say. Narrations, indeed. 99, timeline, dominated. Let's see the map here quickly. Is there anything we missed? Not sure if we could have made, made a dock here. Not that it would have helped too much. Stole it with the trade cart. <laughs> the bastard. Got a bridge down there. I don't think there's anything else we really missed out on here. There's enough gold scattered around that you wouldn't really have gold issues either. Especially up here. Like, I'm still mining this gold. We found that very early. Why is there two wolves here? Wait, Pegasus? Siggy? What the hell is this? Is this some secret homage to someone? Like, uh, fans? Or like, uh... They have pretty decent stats. Easter egg? Probably the devs' dogs. Yeah, it wouldn't, be, it wouldn't surprise me, right? Wait, is this? Looks almost like it's on fire in there. Siggy? Well, Siggy is like double the strength of Pegasus anyway. The her Ah... HP could be their birthdays, but it's not six numbers here. Not sure how that would be their birth. I mean, 11th, 3rd, 07 maybe. I don't know. There's no, no point speculating. We can uh, wonder what happens if you kill them. I don't think anything happens. Maybe you get like a pop. How dare you kill my, my precious pets? Uh, but yeah, we could uh, 30, 07, 11. We could ask the devs, you know. Give them a tweet and ask them what that's about. Hey, we even got like 8,000 gold in trade. Not bad, not bad. Cool, alright. We are once again complete and finished with all the campaigns in the Age of Empires 2 DE. Well, to be fair, I haven't played through all the campaigns in DE standard, you can say. But we have, uh, like, since they got updated. But we have now, once again, played through every single campaign in the game. There's a lot of them, a lot of campaigns, and we will also be doing the campaigns in Age of Empires 4. So the next campaign video you will see on YouTube will be Age of Empires 4 campaigns. We're excited for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Hope you enjoyed the Jan Shishka campaigns. And what's the name of the most recent DLC? What's the name of the DLC we just had? Someone tell me. Dawn of the Dukes. Yes, hope you enjoyed the Dawn of the Dukes campaigns. I think they're probably the best of the bunch in terms of, like, quality. Thorough, throughout, qu quality throughout. Very well done to them for that. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next video.